What up everybody, it's your boy Marsha the Don coming at you guys with another video and in today's video we're going to be discussing the most recent Roblox ban wave. So I haven't uploaded a video in over two months. Firstly, I'm sorry for the lack of uploads and I'm sorry that I've made all my other previous videos private or unlisted. I had my own reasons for doing that. If you guys want to stay up to date with anything Sir Meme, then I highly recommend you subscribe, turn on notifications, and check out my weekly Friday live streams. I'm live on YouTube every single Friday, so you don't want to miss that. And I also have a second YouTube channel, which is completely powered by Sir Meme AI. So go subscribe to the channel on screen. It's called Roblox Scripts. I've had it for a while now, but I've actually started uploading again. So if you missed the old school Sir Meme videos, go get your fix from the Sir Meme AI power channel so let's not waste any more time let's get straight into today's video so yesterday on the 13th of august 2024 roblox initiated a ban wave and this time the ban wave has been deleting people's accounts so yes account terminations are finally here roblox is not playing around anymore i've literally been warning you guys about this for so long now i've been telling you guys for months and months and months to prepare for this to use alt accounts to start buying second devices just to exploit on finally judgment day is here accounts have been deleted accounts have been terminated and i'm here to explain what the hell is going on for you guys so to understand what is happening now you firstly need to understand how the banning system works so the banning system works on a free strike system the first time you get banned is a one day the second time you get banned is a free day and the third time you get banned is a seven day now if you get banned after the seven day you would get your account terminated or deleted now the reason this has never happened before is because previously ban wave records were only stored for 30 days at a time and roblox was never known to do more than one ban wave every few months or even you know one or two ban waves a year in the past now we've got hyperion we've got a dedicated team and recently they've now changed the records to be kept for over one year so all the current ban wave records from this point onwards will be kept for a 12 month time period which means for example if you get banned in january you will get a one day ban if you get caught in another ban wave in april you will get a three day ban if you get caught in another ban wave in august you will get a seven day ban and if you get caught in another ban wave in october your account will be deleted now in response to this ban wave i have seen many many people asking the same question over and over again can I get my account undeleted can I get my deleted account restored is there a way to appeal this ban to Roblox somebody actually put this question forward to one of the members of the anti-cheat team bit dancer who works for Roblox and he responded with not by us I can ask tomorrow if there's a way but please don't get your hopes up so use common sense guys if your headless core blocks account has been deleted it's probably going to stay deleted but there's no harm in sending an appeal to Roblox who knows you might get lucky and you might have your account restored Moving on to the second most asked question that I have seen since this ban wave has first taken place is I never received a warning. I never got a one day ban. I never got a seven day ban. I never got a three day ban. My account, my headless core blocks account just got instantly deleted off the face of the earth. Someone also put this question forward to the Roblox anti-cheat staff member BitDancer and he, he responded with you most likely accumulated so many violations during the time frame we selected for banning but the total violation count resulted in an immediate account deletion. You know, in BitDancer's defense, he did warn people for over a year. So just to put, just, just to give an example of what this means, they could select the time frame for, you know, the previous 12 months. And if, it, if they selected the previous 12 months and your account has been caught in more than three band waves, that would make sense as to why your account has been deleted today. So if you were one of those people, like I said, I do feel your pain, but it's pretty much game over right now. All you can do is appeal or you know you can bite the bullet and keep taking that risk but as i said probably the best way to execute scripts on roblox right now is android ios mac or to, if you want to execute on pc is to use a separate pc to your main pc and spoof as much as you possibly can use a vpn spoof mac address do everything you possibly can to protect yourself that's literally the only way and i'm saying that for all the people out there that care about their accounts and for some reason still want to execute scripts on their main account it's just not worth it in my eyes personally i don't see any point in executing scripts on your main accounts anymore you might as well if you really want to go through and still execute scripts on roblox i suggest using alt accounts only as i have always done for the entirety of 2024 so i'm going to keep 
screaming, use alt accounts only, use second devices. So yeah, things are getting really interesting right now, guys. The band wave has hit people hard. Let me know what you think in the comments. So which executors were affected by this band wave? Now I can say with 100% certainty that Wave, Synapse Z, Celery, and Solara were all included in this band wave. I can't say the same for Android, iOS, or Mac executors. I also can't say the same for DX9. So if you if you have any information on DX9, please comment down below. But as for Android, Android doesn't really make a lot of sense for me. I don't know if Android users are getting caught in these band waves. From what BitDancer is saying, it doesn't seem like there's any significant security features on Android as somebody already asked if there's going to be anti-cheat for iOS in the future and BitDancer responded with there will be but Android is next and if we pull up some of his previous posts talking about Android you know we spoke about Android earlier in August like almost a week ago he said I did confirm that something similar is coming Android it seems like he's still looking to clap Android users so judging by all of these comments from the Roblox staff member I would say that Android users have been safe from this ban wave even though I have seen people posting banned messages of them from using mobile you know, I just don't believe it right now that's my personal opinion you know do what you will with that guys final screenshot I want to bring up is this one right here you know he says right at the end rest assured we are also coming for cheaters on Android and then for iPhone and Mac so judging by the wording of this I would say that Android iPhone and Mac are pretty safe for now but they're not gonna be safe forever so Android users you should be shitting your pants right now iPhone and Mac users you're still okay for now and iPhone and Mac users are still good for now so that's about it for this band wave report video you know there's not much to talk about I literally just wanted to make this video just so those of you that aren't already aware of terminations taking place you're now aware of it so you know you can make that decision if you still want to keep executing scripts on Roblox or not or if, if you know you want to stop using your main account and start using alt accounts it's probably a good time to start doing that so thanks for watching guys I appreciate all the support you guys have given me non-stop support since I first started doing videos in this community in 2017 you know you guys have been crazy with the support it's crazy that we're still here in 2024 hopefully BitDancer can bring an end to this soon but hey I'm here to ride it out till the very and so once again appreciate the support guys comment down below what you want to see next make sure to subscribe to my second channel if you haven't already join the patreon support me become a member leave a like turn on notifications and i'll see you guys in the next one peace help us cheat buddy you're our only hope mother i did not have cheats on my pc i don't have no cheats fuck you you pig